Hi, friends from around the world. Here we are again on the Mindset Series. Today is a very important one and it burns down many of the concepts you uh, already have heard, you have known, but it burns down to something which is um, important for, which has ramifications in, into, into any other things. Now, uh, the first thing here is commitment. Do you have commitment? Well, we are <clears throat> not very far from the year end and uh, the beginning of the year. You know, I will commit to, uh, I will get a slim figure. I will uh, make some changes to my life and I will uh, not smoke anymore and I will not this and I will do that. So there are a wish list of five, six things which normally you commit to at the beginning of the year. And then as a week goes by, uh, well, there's not many of the commitment left. So uh, it is what you said at the beginning, but then it turns over. Uh, it is, uh, uh, you know, your old habits, they take over. That is not commitment, right? A commitment is, well, I would not go so far to burn the bridges. You know, when the uh, Spanish, they went over to America and uh, they're, uh, you know, one continent and uh, 500 people and how will we conquest the, uh, the, the continent, the American continent? Well, burn your bridges. You can't go back. There's no, there's death or there's life. And if there's death and life, what uh, would you think will prevail? Yes, you're right. Life will prevail. So that happened. So if you burn your bridges, well, even better, because then you will get that commitment. You have to go forward or uh, there's no option to, uh, to, you know, no, no other option. There's no other option to, uh, to quit. Quitting is not an option, right? Uh, and the commitment should be like this. Quitting is not an option. <clears throat> and if you go forward, if you have your goal clear, then you do it anyway. Why you do it? Well, uh, you say often, I do not do it because I do not have the resources. I do not have the, uh, the money. I do not have the connection. I do not have uh, the, uh, the, uh, you know, the politicals in my pocket. I have not, um, I'm not uh, uh, beautiful enough. I'm not this, I'm not that. These are resources. And you say you do not have the resources. Well, that's wrong. That's wrong. Let, let that sink in. That is wrong. Because the, uh, re, uh, the real resources, they do not come from the resource. They come from the resourcefulness. So uh, if you are resourceful, you get the resources. So it is the other way around. You say, I do not have the resources. That is incorrect. You are resourcefulness. And what is resourcefulness with regard to resources? Well, resourcefulness is emotions. What does change our life? Change our life is emotions. When you get married, why is that? There are, there are emotions uh, in the way, right? Uh, so you, uh, every important thing are uh, driven by emotions. Why are you uh, still at working at two o'clock in the morning because you have business to finish? That is emotions. You want to go through. That is an emotion you have. So uh, everything goes through, your real driver of uh, your own world is emotions. And emotions are yours. You have them. They are inside you. You just let not drive them, drive yourself the emotions. No, you think, uh, well, uh, the resort, because it is more comfortable. The, the uncomfortable action, so changing your life. You are in a kind of state of mind, well... Uh, it is not good, but I'm going through. That is not the right way to uh, to succeed. So you have to commit, and you have you have to recognize that you have the resourcefulness. Resourcefulness. You have the emotions, and through the emotions, you get to find your way. Your mind get to find your way when you have the ideas clear. Where do you want to go? Now you do not know where do you want to go. Your mind doesn't know, the mind does not uh, uh, know on its own where to go. You have to find, uh, uh, you have to give the right orders to your mind and your mind then find the way, then find the resourcefulness, then uh, put the emotion into your service. 
that is what you uh, what you uh, what you need to uh, recognize resource you have all the the resources at your disposal if you drive if you're driven by the emotions and the emotions will give you on their way uh, once you get one step another step another step emotions grow <laughs> emotions grow big and they help you to go to the next step and then uh, emotions grow uh, grow a bit more then you go to the next step and so it goes so it goes so it is it is just <clears throat> the other it is shifting it's the other way around you need to detect the uh, the the resourcefulness the goal and the res and you go through the resourcefulness in order to get to the goal and then you get the resources because they come they come on their on their own way they they you do not need uh, to to get them you do not need to to have a million of dollars in order to <laughs> to to make what <laughs> to make what exactly yeah you need to know what the resource is not, not the solution. No, the emotions, the goal, the internal brain, that is the solution to whatever problem you have detected. Enjoy your day.